I'd like to thank Alvernia University and its inspirational president, Tom Flynn, for bestowing upon Berks Catholic High School the Pro Urbe Award. This award is symbolic of a rich history of cooperation between the Diocese of Allentown and Alvernia University in pursuing the Catholic Church's mission of evangelization. I am very proud of this history and I'm very dedicated to pursuing it with President Flynn and the Board of Alvernia deeply into the future. Many saints throughout the years walking the hallways of Berks Catholic High School with the formation they need in every sense to make dynamic 21st century contributions, drawing on the inspirational past, but moving vibrantly and creatively into the future. We have provided an excellent leadership for this new Catholic high school, and we know that our emphasis will be Christ-centered academic excellence that really explores the truths of our Catholic faith, that helps uh, students expand and deepen their spiritual life, and in so doing, allows them to follow the lead of the Holy Spirit in their lives to dynamic career paths and vocations that make a difference and a contribution to both the church and to the world. I'm humbled and honored to be the first principal of Berks Catholic High School. When Bishop Barris uh, called and appointed me the first principal, uh, it was such an honor. Uh, there's such a legacy in Berks County uh, from Central Catholic and Holy Name, and now we have this new era in Berks County of secondary Catholic education in Berks Catholic. And what more could you ask for but such a vibrant legacy to draw upon? A new era in Catholic education has begun in Berks County. Celebrating a proud past and a glorious future, Berks Catholic High School is prepared to meet the needs of students of the 21st century in the strong tradition of Christ-centered academic excellence that have been the hallmark of Catholic education at Central Catholic and Holy Name. Everything we do at Berks Catholic is going to be centered on Jesus, uh, centered in the Catholic faith. Uh, first and foremost, our goal will be to allow our young people to grow spiritually. Um, second, it'll be a vibrant family-like atmosphere that they can um, celebrate through sports and theater and music and academics, uh, yearbook, whatever their God-given abilities and talents might be. Uh, thirdly, we're going to offer a tremendous, rigorous academic curriculum that they'll be able to grow academically and uh, explore different uh, options. As we embrace the exciting future of Berks Catholic High School, we pause to review the rich history of Catholic education in Berks County. The humble roots of Catholic education may be traced back to Goschenhaven, now Bally, Pennsylvania, when, in 1743, Father Theodore Schneider opened a parochial school. A Catholic school has existed in this site to this day. The present school, St. Francis Academy in Bally, is believed to be the oldest continually operated Catholic parochial school in the United States. The roots of Catholic secondary education in Berks County are traced back to the efforts of St. John Newman. Fourth Bishop of Philadelphia, who in 1859 helped to establish an elementary school at St. Peter's in Reading. Later, Early in the 20th century, a secondary program was added at St. Peter's. The saints that will walk the halls of Berks Catholic today will join the ranks of the Cardinals and Blue Jays that have gone before them. The establishment of Berks Catholic High School will continue in the strong tradition of faith formation and academic excellence that has been the tradition of Catholic education in Berks County even before the formation of our country. Mm -hmm.